Okay guys, so hey, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? So today I am doing another DIY video and I am doing a blanket ladder. I did a blanket ladder uh, DIY video a few years ago and it turned out okay, but it was kind of wobbly. It was like my first time doing um, a DIY anything um, in terms of building furniture. And so I think I got the hang of this thing now so I can, you know, I'm no, no longer a novice. <laughs> so I am super excited. I'm going to be using um, two by two by fours. I'm going to be using two by fours and it's going to be so much sturdier. I believe it's four feet tall and I didn't, I, at first I wanted like an eight foot um, blanket ladder, but I'm just like, why? <laughs> I don't necessarily need that so I'm actually going to be putting it in my family room um, I have two like pictures um, that's on the wall it's like mirrored photo frames I have two of those that's on the wall and it's sort of one under the other and I'm going to be putting the blanket ladder right underneath it so this blanket ladder is not going to be like your normal size blanket ladder is going to be very wide because I want to be able to put at least two to three blankets on there on each um you know step ladder so I'm very excited hopefully it'll turn out the way that I see it in my head <laughs> hopefully it does so without further ado let's get into this video okay so I do have my two by fours here and they're already cut to about four feet and I am going to be cutting the slats down myself because I kind of wanted them to be a particular size um, and then I'm just going to be screwing them into, into, the, um, into the ladder. So I'm very excited you guys. This is going to be so awesome, so great. And yeah, let's get started. Make sure that this baby is even. instead of using the other two by fours because for some reason it just wasn't cutting I think where I needed it to cut had a knot there and so it wasn't cutting so I just decided to use these one by eights and um, I think it's going to come out even better <laughs> so let's go ahead and assemble this put this together <laughs> My 
blanket ladder for my living room, family room area. Now, I don't know if I want to stain it or if I want to paint it white. Um, I think that I might just do like a whitewash. I'm not really sure. I did get a little bit of chalkboard paint there, but I'm not really sure if I want to do a whitewash or if I want to stain it or if I want to leave it the raw wood. I actually do like the raw wood and it's kind of crazy, but I do like the fact that it has like all this label that's on there. It's kind of farmhousey to me, um, but we'll see. But there you go. So you guys, be sure and stay tuned to the next episode so you can see how I styled it. I do think I am going to leave it raw. I'm just going to sand it down and um, kind of seal it. So yeah, stay tuned to the next episode so you can see how I styled it in my living room. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, I would love for you to do so. It is always free. Um, also hit that bell down below so that you can get new videos of whatever I do upload. Um, I'm aiming to upload on a daily basis. <laughs> so um, make sure you subscribe and don't forget that Jesus is Lord and that Jesus loves you and I love you too. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.